Many children are spending their summer in various camps, spending time at the pool, and learning about what they may want to be when they grow up. One is a bit different, though, than most, and the presentation at the end isn't your typical recital. It's actually a full-on production. ABC 2's Lamont Williams spent the day at Camp Hippodrome. Direction. That sofa needs to come out in a hurry, and people need to be right with it, please. Correction. The thinks you can think, because what I'm hearing now is things. Perfect and now, encouragement. You, know. you, you, you got those chops. You can do it. <laughs> you can do it. That's what children get here. Welcome to Camp Hippodrome. Not your normal summer camp, but one that promotes learning the performing arts. Sponsored by the Hippodrome Foundation, it's a series of one-week camps where more than 300 middle school students from partnering schools can come and learn theater and stage from performers and past graduates. Really hard to teach them in four days, but with these kids, they're very, they want to learn, and they're really excited to learn about this stuff. The camp is more than about performing. It pushes you from the shadows of shyness and shines light on hidden talents. I used to take it all for granted. Having a stage presence, being on stage, you know, like, um, I feel like when I get on stage, it's like I'm supposed, I'm supposed to be there. Men should never be made property. Men should never be made merchandise. As all men bear God's image, they should never be instruments. I learned that I can sing very well and do theater, and I can become something if I try hard. I haven't really done anything with tech until the camp, and then I learned all this tech, things that can help me in the future in my career. And the Hippodrome Foundation makes sure everyone can attend. Camps like this would be maybe $1,000 just, just for, like, this one week, and, you know, it's free for them. And that's another thing that I like seeing is the diversity of all the kids. The campers will be performing on stage before invited guests tomorrow, but don't come expecting a middle school recital. They shouldn't expect a bunch of kids. They should expect people that, that are older than usual, people that have grown, and people that will do their best, and it will be great. In Baltimore, I'm Lamont Williams, ABC2 News.